welcome back to my channel. So today everything's going to be a little different. Um, a couple of things that I have to let you guys know. I have decided to um, set up things a little differently with my cash envelopes and my um, sinking funds. Um, that prop money that you see on the side there, that is my prop money from my magic month. It looks like I'm not going to be able to do the magic month. I worked it out over and over again. I just cannot figure it out right now. Now, um, what I have in the magic month here um, is about $50. Uh, these new Ziploc envelopes, just to let you guys know, is from Intentional Living. Um, I did make a mistake here. I'm going to put back my savings <laughs> Ziploc bag and uh, deal with the savings um, a little later. But right now, with my cash envelope, I'm going to set aside my spending and my fun envelope aside for the next couple of weeks. Um, and then I'll get back to you guys on what I'm going to be doing with that later on. But I need to be concentrating on how to pay my debt down. And um, I don't want to be using my credit card for my groceries anymore. So I will be using my I will be transferring my grocery fund back into my cash envelope so that um, I can use that as an everyday occurrence. Um, I'm not sure about my eating out envelope. I keep going back and forth on whether or not I should set that aside, but I'm going to go ahead and just keep it in there. So what I have in my health, I'm sorry, in my uh Magic month here is 50 bucks. I did take out $20, 20, 30, 40, 45, 42. I'm sorry, let's do that again. It's 50 bucks. It's, um, I'm going to put 50 bucks, um, five, I'm sorry, five dollars. I'm going to be putting into my health envelope in just a minute here. Now, I do have the $50 that I took out of my account. Um, and then um, right now I'm going to pull out my cash envelopes. That's my gas. That's my spending. Again, I'm putting my spending and my fun envelope aside for the next couple of weeks. I'm not going to contribute to them because it doesn't make any sense for me to do that. I'm going to take out the card from fun and I'm actually going to um, put that into the grocery fund card. Um, I'm sorry, I put it into the wrong uh, envelope, but it's actually going into my grocery um, envelope. And um, because I can use I can get groceries at Target too. That's about two dollars on that card that I can use at Target. So those are the three, these are the three envelopes that I'm going to be using, which is gas, eating out, and miscellaneous. Again, I'm, I keep going back and forth with the eating out, whether or not I should be putting money in there. But I am going to put $10 into my gas for right now because I did borrow $10 from that um, earlier to get uh, something for the kids and I. So I'm going to put $10 back into the gross, into gas. Excuse me. Miscellaneous has, um, I believe, about $4 in it right now. Um, I did put an additional dollar in there um, previously because I had some change and I just put it into the miscellaneous. So right now I'm going to go ahead. Rent is not getting anything. Beauty's not getting anything, but health will be getting the $5 um, prop money that's sitting over there because I added the $5 into to the um, health category in my account. And um, 
I will be paying my co-payment for my son. We just had a, an appointment for him. So that's where that's going to be going. So that's going to be gone in a few days. Uh, birthday and kids are not getting anything. Um, so groceries should be there somewhere. If I can find it and pull it out. Did I pull it out? No. I'm going to get there. There it is. <laughs> There's the grocery. So the $40 that's left is going into the groceries. Uh, so um, what I have in there so far with the $40 will be, and I'm, I'm going to count it right now, 20, 40, 50, 60, 6, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, and 75. So I have $75 for groceries um, that I'm going to be spending for this week. And, I, you know, it's a funny thing about my groceries. I am not a very good shopper. I go into the grocery store and I get something for $75 and look at it and like, what did I do with the money? I don't understand. I don't, I didn't even get anything enough for this week. Uh, I'm really, really horrible at the grocery um, uh, purchases that I get. So that is pretty much it. Um, I do want you to know, I don't want you guys to forget about the upside. It's a um, app that you can use to download on your phone to purchase your um, gas. And you, if you use my code and my link, um, you can get up to 15, 15 cents per gallon off for your first claim. I will leave the link in my description box. I also wanted to tell you guys about Acron. It's in a bank account that I've been a member of for a couple of years now. It's a really great way for you to start to invest into your, invest your money. They actually do it for you. I know a lot of people don't want to be bothered with um, investing. The Acron is a really good way for you to, in, to let someone else do that for you. So I will put that link in the description so that um, you guys could um, use my link to get an extra five dollars if you once you deposit your first uh, five dollars into an investment account so that's it for today and until next time bye for now mm -hmm.